what's up y'all today i'm going to be showing you my makeup routine well not routine but like makeup my skincare and all of that stuff it's gonna be so fun and y'all can come along with me <laughs> Let's get right into it. So first, I'm just gonna put on my headband, what I always use. Just, this helps get your hair out of the way while you're doing stuff. So I just like putting it back. Oh my God. I just like putting it back. And if it gets out of the way, it, I will start putting another headband behind it. But so far, we'll just see it. Okay, so I'm excited. Don't mind this band on my arm. But anyways, I don't know what we should use first. But I'm thinking just to start off with a base. So we're going to use the Cloud Surf Water Cream Moisturizer. And this is like one of my favorite moisturizers. It hydrates so well. And you can make the little butterfly. Salut. And then with that, I use um, the Float On um, facial oil from Bubble. Just one tiny drop because this gets your face really oily. It's good if you have really dry skin. And then I'm going to use some the Ordinary Seed Oil. So put that. Okay, that should be enough. Okay, and I'm just going to mix it all in something really little and then we're just gonna apply it to my face and don't mind the faces I do when I do my makeup and stuff it's just to like get everywhere on your skin to make sure every spot on your skin is getting the hydration that every other spot is or whatever you're using so we're just gonna keep rubbing this in Okay, that should be good. So, um, we're gonna prime. Yeah, we're gonna prime. Um, and I'm using some, y'all might think this is the Say Dew Drops. Uh, I would think that's how you say it, but it's fine. But it's not. It's this primer. I don't know where it's from, but it's like one of my favorite primers. It's kind of like a dupe of this Say Dew Drops. Um, but it's from a different brand. Because this makes my face... And I have the... Wait, hold up. Okay, anyways. I have the, um... Other kind of it. I don't know how to say it. I think it's somewhere down here. But I just rub this in to prime my face. And I don't know what look I'm gonna go for. But we're gonna go for a look. I know that. Okay, so the foundation I use is e.l.f. The halo glow this stuff is amazing and it's really viral uh well people just like using it a lot i can never get this thing opened my hands are so wet <sighs> hold up a sec technical difficulties and yeah it's like so satisfying that and that noise did not sound good it has a lot in it though like it's a lot so I just take it and rub it all on my face. And it gets a lot out of one scoop. So I just like scooping the edges of the swab. And I don't, I just do one dab and a straight line on my nose. Yeah, okay. So yeah, that's what I use. And then I'm just gonna blend it in with my beauty blender. And um, when you're using a beauty blender, okay, I think I might have said that wrong. Beauty blender, yeah. Um, you just want to tap. You don't want to go too aggressive um, on your skin. I mean, it depends how you like it. But I think of when I'm um, blending my stuff in, it's like um, a massage. Like, I really like it. So I kind of go a little hard. That just depends how you like it. I don't go too hard, like I don't go, Argh. I just go like this and it gets on my skin. Okay, I think that's good. 
I am so happy that we hit over a thousand subscribers. Like we're at like a thousand one hundred now, and that's amazing. Like that's literally amazing. What are we gonna do next? That's loud. Um. So here's my. Oh yeah. So we have concealer, blush, contour. I don't know, highlighting stick, I guess. Um, mishaps. <laughs> Correct any mishaps, mishaps. Um, this is just shape my nose. I use this a lot. Y'all might have seen it. Um, here's my setting powder. And I'll just get more stuff out if I need it. So we're just gonna go ahead and grab my concealer and I use different beauty blenders for each so this is my foundation one it gets really dirty my concealer one isn't as dirty but it's, you can barely see it but so yeah this concealer is from AOA studio you might not know that but that's what it says it's kind of hard to see oh my gosh it scared me and then it's logs creamy concealer and it's like really creamy and I love it. So I just add a little there. And like, I try to like lift my eyes up with this stuff. Like I go in the up position, but I don't know. And then I do three lines here with a little down my nose. I don't go all the way down. And then I just, um, I think that'll be fine. Cause my mishaps, <laughs> mishaps. Um, and then I just blend that in very gently around my eyes cause this stuff I've gotten in my eyes before, and it sucks. I mean, anything getting in your eyes sucks it sucks to me. Like water, I get so scared. I panic. I'm like, what's in my eye? And I don't want to open my eye. Even though, I don't, I just don't know. And, I don't know what I'm going to say after and, but. Oh, also, have you all seen, like, those people in Australia? They swim with their eyes opened in the salt water? That's legit crazy. Like, Anyways, we're going to use the mishap, like, not the mishaps, why do we keep saying that? We're using the Bare Minerals, I do not know how to say that, but it's a Gen Nude shade, and it's just um, a base for mishaps, and I have a bunch of them, I don't have a bunch. They're just spots that don't match, and they get, you know. So we're just gonna blend that out. And I use the same beauty blender for these two. So, um, and yeah, okay. That should be good. Yeah, good, right? Oh my gosh, I can't get my life together. Anyways, we are going to use now the Pitsy Glow On Blush. I love these things because they're blush and I they're actually like a really, a really pretty lip stain or something. And then here's my, I use a brush to blend this out. And I just go in up position and this is like a very fluffy brush. It's super soft. Um, So I keep it like this and I'll just go a straight line then start curving down until I get to the like tip of my nose if I go up it should end up with that line and yeah that's how I do it some people do it different and yeah sometimes it doesn't match perfectly but at least if the sides match you can barely see that it's fine let me turn this light on okay It's not working. Great. The time I need it, it doesn't work. So that's that happened to y'all a lot. Like the time you need something, it doesn't work. It happens to me a lot. Um, so I'm just blending in the upward position, trying to get this to look as good as possible. And then I'm gonna use something else after this. Could just get this to go. Okay, so that's enough. And then I'll just like 
blend the extras out into my okay so here i'm gonna use a liquid blush to get more of my cheek area because this is just to lift up and make it so now i'm just gonna go in line with my nose just a little dot usually i do oh my god it's coming out it's i get so scared I don't know if that's even. We'll figure out in a second. And yeah. Be. Well, why did I say we? Sometimes, y'all, I say things that I don't even understand why I said them. And I also got this blush from. Oh, yeah. This blush is from Disney. It's an Ulta Beauty liquid blush. It's like, I got it from a Disney set from Ulta. Um, it came in like this sparkly box. I did not know where the box is though. But I keep it in here because I use two different blushes a lot. And I just, okay. That looks better. It's kind of hard to see on camera, but it looks pretty good. Okay. Now I'm gonna highlight i know my steps are weird don't judge me so here are my two highlighters i use this one is like a fit me um i don't know and then i use this it's like a mini highlighter i don't know it's called the bomb and it's just like really highlights and gets that so i just use this kind of over my eyebrows because like this one's a thicker one so i use this anywhere i want thick highlights I use it at the tip at my eye but yeah and then I use actual I use my other beauty blender to blend with this one it's another black one and I just tap pat in above my eyebrows slay 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 what's y'all's favorite song which like my favorite song probably that um i don't really have a favorite song like i like every single song like if someone shows me a song i'm in love with it why is there a hole inside it i don't know it's kind of questioning but don't question things so i'm just gonna do a line down my nose this stuff gets very shiny and then i do lines really close to my eye in the middle and then i do some in this little centerpiece usually you don't do anything there but you see that like that centerpiece i do a little bit there and then that should be good okay yeah see awesome okay good um should i do my stick or my bronze, probably use bronze first, so I can just get on top of that. Okay, so I use a brush for my bronzer. I have a bronzing brush. It's this one. I use this one for, like, no, it's not. Where is my bronzing? Br Wait, is that it? No, it's this one. Okay, this is my bronzing brush. It's like has these cute 3D water drops on it, and it's like super fluffy and i use this darker brush because it doesn't mess up it like i don't want to use one of my white brushes because like this would totally get ruined <sighs> yeah and i haven't used that yet that's why it's so white if i used it once it would already been getting dirty so i just Does that look too dark? Okay, I feel like that looks even enough. So, yeah, that's good. Good, good, good. And then I use my Stay Matte stuff, and I use this brush for it. It's like, oh yeah. Did I tell you what the bronzer I use? Well, the bronzer I used was the YC Collection. 
sponsor and it has a little mirror on it say hello to you guys hello to you and then the bronzing and then i use the stay matte powder but i used it a lot this thing has broken and there's like a big gigantic hole um and then i use this bumpy brush to use it like i don't know it just feels really good on my skin applying this to it so and some of you are probably like you should probably apply that before you do blush or something i can do like i can do whatever i want i can't really do whatever i want because like i have to listen to my parents sometimes but like it just looks better when i do my makeup like that so and i don't add a lot i add a little little thin liner nothing much okay that looks awesome so we're gonna do my eyebrows now so i take that's weird anyways i have this eyebrow palette it's from the disney thing and it's from ulta that the disney box that i came with where did i oh yeah the the liquid blush so i use this light shade and just rub it on my finger and I'll politely apply it on and then I use a tiny skinny brush and apply it on it's like an eyeshadow brush but it's not it's a skinnier than eyeshadow brush and I just go I just rub it in my eyebrows and I don't know how I don't care how my eyebrows look while I'm applying them because I'm fixing them in a second I don't do much to my eyebrows. This is all I do. I do a little, I do like three steps. Cause I don't really care much for my eyebrows. Okay. That looks somewhat even. And then I take one dot of this dark and add it right in the center or where it looks like it may be. Okay. beautiful she's beautiful she looks kind she probably gives you butterflies okay so the second thing i use is the oh yeah i still need this i use this it's like a sticky solution i just take it a little fingertip and apply a little bit that one's super sticky and then i take this brow gel clear it's called clear brow gel and i just add a little thin layer of this so i because this has a lot on the brush so i swirl it in the tube like that and it should not end up with as much as it was and then i just dip in again same thing And then that's all I do for my eyebrows. Like, literally, that's all I do. Don't do a lot. But, okay, so now I'm going to go with my... I just touched my eyebrows. I have my eyes. So, I... Hmm, let me think. So, my eyes, I'm not sure if I want to go with the nude palette. This is from Morphe. I don't know how to say it. I don't know if I want to go with this nude palette. Can add a wing? I probably do. So I'm going to go with this nude palette. Um, and I have this, another stick from the Disney collection from Old Time. It's just a highlighting stick, so I'm going to use this as well. Put everything back that I'm not in. So let me get myself together real quick. Okay, so I'm put together now, so I have all the stuff I'm using for my eyes. So the first thing y'all know is I'm using this eyeshadow palette. Um, it's all the nude colors um like that y'all see y'all swaps again and then i need to prime my eyes so this is another it's not the one i used in the beginning it's another one it's like a little shade lighter but i'm using one of these to prime my eyes i showed y'all this is from the disney collection i'm using this and then i'm using a eye pencil <laughs> so the first thing i'm gonna do is prime my eyes 
So we're just gonna rub this all over. And I'm also doing my eyelashes, but I'm not doing them. It's not like part of my eyelids. And then I'm just gonna rub that in with my fingers. Cause I don't have, I don't know if I should use a brush with this. Cause I barely do my eyes, so I barely know. Okay, so my eyes are primed. Now we're gonna go in with the eyeshadow. And we're gonna use another skinny brush. It's not the same one I use for my eye eyebrows. But it's in like another one. I like this like style. I have a bunch of these that are like this style. It's super cute. So what shade should I use? Hmm, okay. So I'm thinking to go with just a base on top with a light. And then um, maybe with either one of these. And then I'm going with a... A glitter, sorry, couldn't get a word out of my mouth. I think I might do this glitter. And then I'm gonna, that's gonna be all for my eyes. So the first one we're gonna go in is this powder one. And we're just gonna powder it on the tip. So it's basically like another primer. It's just lighter. On the back seat. Uh, uh, some people do their eyes before they do their, like, stuff so it doesn't get on themselves, but I don't like that style, so, but that's my opinion. Uh, um, I feel like I got way more on that eye than I did on this one. I feel like one eye is always so much better than the other one. Do y'all feel like that sometimes? Okay. And my, eye my eyelashes might get some colors on it, but that's why... I do this last. Yeah, this is what I use, but I'm not telling you that until we're at that part. Okay, so then I said I wanted maybe the nude regular color. And I think I might combine these three to get a different color. Um, so we're going to take this one. Just apply it on the tip doesn't look any different so then we're going to take a dub the darker one okay and then the darker one not on the back See, can you tell the difference i can but i cannot so we're going to go in with the darker shade oh yeah oh yeah yeah, we're going with this shade. She's beautiful. She looks kind. She probably gives you butterflies. Okay, I like that. It's like a smoky eye. Looks like I just got a blister. I mean, not a blister, a bruise. But I like it. Like, I honestly really like it. So, gotta do the same thing to this eye. So, I'll be right back. So, as y'all saw, it was kind of sped up a little bit because I wanted, didn't y'all want to see the actual time, but I got them somewhat even. And I know it looks dark, but that's like my style. I like nude colors. Okay, so now we're going to go in with the Disney thing. And I don't know why the caps are switched. I do not like that. So, I think I'm going to go in with the highlighter in the middle and then the dark one at the ends. So we're just gonna take this highlighter and put it in the center. And, okay. Okay, I like that a lot. And then we're gonna do the dark one at the ends. We're not adding a lot of this one because we're gonna add something else at the ends. But I feel like that looks so good. And now, the hard part is the wing. This is going to take me so many tries. I'm going to open this thing again so I can have a close-up mirror. So, we are going to try to do this. Hopefully, I don't mess up. Okay. That's 
some So it's bad, but um, I legit don't know what I'm doing. Oh my god, that looks good. I feel like it needs to be more left. Okay. So I I I I I just got out of the room and these are not post about that. Okay. Anyways. Do y'all like that? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not good at wings, so don't judge me for doing them terribly. But the hard one is this one. This one's going to turn out better than the other one. I just know it because... Okay. Already done? Beautiful. I like it so much. Okay, so we can put, oh my gosh. It looks so good. The last thing I do is we're just gonna prime my lips. And y'all think that's so weird. But I don't really prime my lips a lot. And I was scrolling and I heard it's like a bad thing if you don't prime your lips. So we're priming them real quick. Like, okay. Anyways, we're taking the mishaps one. I don't know how to call it. Not the one I used to prime my eye. And I just take this and then bond it on my lips. <laughs> and then I don't know what to do with my lips, so I'm just going to go classic, or you know, I'm going to go with a pink lip stain. I know this is not gonna turn out well. I already think I messed up a little bit. Oh, okay. So I'm gonna wait a minute. So it's kinda hard to talk because I don't want to touch them that y'all saw just a second ago that uh they kind they let them sit and dry for a second, so they are still a little wet. So we're gonna wait a little longer and then I'll be back when they're sort of dry. So they, so as y'all can see, I peeled it off and I just added a gloss on top. I love this gloss and it ended up a really light pink, which I was like, hmm. So I think I look really good. Um, so I'm just gonna take this band off and, uh, oh wait, I forgot to do my lashes. <laughs> this band goes back on. We're just gonna. Usually, I prime my lashes, but I'm not going to right now. But if you've been watching, if you watch my get ready with me on my channel, you can see some. Oh, there y'all go, falling off the universe. Y'all can see that I use it. It's like in a light thing, and I'll use it on my eyes. Hello. Okay, so this is my look. I am not a makeup artist, guys, so I do not do the best things, but I feel like I did really good, and last time I showed y'all my makeup, it looks super bad in here, but I'm going to go out in the light and show y'all, and it's going to look so pretty. Yeah, so here's my look. I know it looks so much different in the sun, but I think I did pretty well. Okay, so since y'all watch this video, I want y'all to go like and subscribe if, to my channel if you're not. Um, and it will really help. Let's see if we can get to 2,000, um, before July. 
That's a goal. Bye.